Hey everybody, down here by the Jarvis Street uh, overpass, where uh, the abandoned DL and W slash NS Vestal service spur uh, basically starts, and I'm going to do a nice little day hike for a few hours through here. And uh, I don't know how deep into the woods off to the sides I'll get into like, you know, into the infrastructure or whatever, because I want to try to get in as much as I can along the way. But, as you can see, this is where it basically starts. And they've had this locked up for a pretty long time for a bit. I mean, it's still shiny, but... Yeah, as you can see, locked up for a long time now. Yeah, and this is a uh, the CP Johnson uh, control point. Yeah, I guess that's what CP stands for. Duh, but yeah, nice little spread of light here to tell when sun's heading out. You know, you got the totem, got the Dwemer, and the Canterbury lights. All right, let's get uh, to hiking. And as you can see, there's like a little substation or something off to the side here, and uh, that's a back side of a plumbing place over there all right i'm gonna get hiking with my bike here a bit and we'll see uh, what we find along the way fine shoes all bricked up Yeah, that looks better. This is the other side of CP Johnson right here. And you can start seeing the elevation. Uh, they put in a rise up here to, I guess, to get up over the river and some of the hills over there in Vestal. This is where it pretty much uh, peels off. Yeah, now we're going to take a bit of a southern swingish to cut through a JC now, Johnson City, and then over into. Uh, Vessel, hopefully. Hey, the old camera works place. You know, it kind of makes me realize that, like, for a lot of layouts, you just board up a lot of windows. You know?
And if I'm not mistaken, that's the Main Street uh, uh, underpass. That's uh, Main Street in Johnson City right there. Shame gets tagged around a lot. Looks like I won't have to like break out the nippers to get through here or whatever. Not like too bad. Maybe I should be able to get through it all. Cross tide, look at that. End of the line for pretty much that, I guess. I mean I'm still going. <laughs> Old factories turned uh, sweet sink wannabe condos. Medical facilities. As far as I know, the only tunnel around here is like um, up north a bit called the Tunnel. But maybe someone's got some info. Maybe this is like a secret Easter egg. Mm. Not really a native here per se, so no clue. Maybe it's just fun. This would have been like quite a nice little dead end to live on. Hey, look, intermodal containers. Wow, look at this old barn house. I love that one. That's nice. Could use some work, but. It's got potential. Too bad location ain't really the best anymore. I guess there used to be an underpass down here. Look at this. Check this out. Wow, look at that. Been forever since I've seen public path like this made. Mm, kind of bland there. 
Let's get down there and take a good look. And... A bit slippery here, doing this one-handed. There we go. Now I got it. There we go. Rebar. I don't know why this is still close up now. I guess they don't want this like collapse on people maybe to be responsible for it. All right, check it out. I think this is uh, the actual power plant uh, switch spur. It goes over to the power plant to, um, I guess the last thing that was there was BAE. I'm not sure, was it BAE? Yeah, here we go. Here's another uh, switch at the plant, right outside the gate. Yeah, this ain't very steady, is it? I did do a video before of this uh, this trestle where I crawled down underneath the pylons and stuff like that. I even found a uh, geocache here once before. And there are, in the spring, goose will come up here and perch up on those pylons. is the Susquehanna River. And there's the sun. I go fishing down here sometimes. Besides fishing, we also do uh, 
kayak and canoe launching through here, portage, you know. There's like a little path under here. Hey, look at you. All right, let's uh, keep going while we still got some daylight to burn. I haven't quite made it to like a old Vestal Road yet. I'm not sure where I am exactly, you know. This place got a little drainage or runoff running down here to the back east. I think those trailers are just outright missing their doors. All right. Yeah, if this was ever mysteriously for some reason to be reactivated, they'd have to take care of this like drainage issue going on here. I just rot them ties out over and over again. Looks like there used to be a, some kind of a road or crossing here. Let's get up there and take a look. This is like the first infrastructure I've seen in a, quite a bit since, uh, since the trestle, really. Railroad related infrastructure, anyways. All I'm seeing is a bunch of like industrial backyard and stuff. All right, yep, let's get a drainage issue. Let's uh, no. Let's see. What, uh, stop. Get my way. No. I guess. This be it right here. All right. I should be able to do this. I'm not fifty yet. All right. Got it. Not that steep, really. Oop. I don't know if a double stack would have been able to come through here. That's quite steep. Look at that. Huh. Soon, even time won't tell. Found another uh, switch out here. Looks like a double set? Or something? Oh, no, no! Duh. Switch for the derailleur. Derail you. Huh. Normally you think it'd be a kind of like after. Hmm. Wonder what that meant. Oh yeah. That was about uh only just about I don't know, five, six hundred feet away from um a destroyed overhead crossing was there. Whatever that was. But yeah. Okay. Let's check this out a bit. Alright. That should be fine for a minute there. Let's go. Uh, let's see. Check this out.
Looks like someone is trying to do some maybe about the drainage at once. Is that a ramp? I don't think this was a pooper. Was this like a field terminal or some something like that? Mm. Here's the other end of that uh field terminal slash transloading operation, I guess in a sense. Check it out, because uh it obviously looks abandoned. <laughs> All right. Probably through here. Oh, I should probably grab my flashlight from the bag. One second. Nah, that's not really helping right now. Oh, look at that motor. That's power right there. I've worked on stuff about, mm, I'd say... Six to ten times bigger. That's got some power there. Actually, I don't, because I don't have a mask. I don't want to bump anything, you know, get dust in the air. Ramco. All right, let's go check up top.
What's up for you, Sally? Oh, fuel terminal right there. Yeah, let's not go too far. There's a bumper right there. Here's another spur. Probably would be like several of the ones throughout here. All right, it's already past four. Sun's about mm, less than an hour of daylight exposure. Gotta get going. I uh, know. Ground. I think this is starting to maybe looking close to end of the road. Because I think the right away it still goes that way. I want to look over there real quick, you know. See if I can find a path that keeps going or something like that. Or if there's like another one that follows that other spur, you know, that gets through there. We'll see here in a bit. Yeah, that's... 413. Look at that. Nice pretty sunset. Oh, not oh. amazing, but pretty. There's a little vessel road. I remember when the bridge was still across here. And it was left in there for a while. They were like, screw it. I don't cut it out. Alright. That's, uh... Pretty much it for me today, I think. I wouldn't bother walking through all that because it was pretty rough. Getting through here just to see this, so. Alright. That's it for today. I'm gonna head back. Eat.